if you are new to my channel this is preetha and in today's video i am going to show you diwali look for 2021 but before moving to that i want to say very happy diwali to everyone and i hope this diwali would bring us the happiness and joy that we are looking for because 2020 and 2021 till date has not been so good to us but i hope this diwali would bring us those happiness back into our life and yeah let's move on to the video i have created this uh, glamorous colorful uh, eye makeup look and this total look is very glamorous as you can see you can carry this in any festival i hope you would like this uh, look creation if you like it please hit the like button do comment below subscribe to my channel and if you want to see how i have achieved this look please keep on watching I already have my face and lips moisturized and for priming my face I am using sugar pore minimizer primer and then for foundation today I am using L'Oreal infallible liquid foundation and I have dotted all over my face and neck area and then I have blended it using a wet sponge because blending is very important otherwise our look would not turn out beautiful After blending my foundation I have taken Edge Rewind concealer from Maybelline and dotted over the dark spots and blemishes that I have and then I have blended it using a wet sponge For highlighting concealer today I am using Maybelline Fit Me concealer in the shade medium I have used it under my eyes on my nose on my forehead and also I have used this concealer as the eye shadow base I have used it on my eyelids and then I have blended it using a wet sponge Then for setting the concealer I am using the translucent powder I have baked my under eye area and also hollows of my cheeks and I have also used it uh, on my eyelids to set the concealer okay let's move on to the eye makeup look i have taken the light rust color from the makeup revolution eye shadow palette and i have applied on to the crease area of my eyelid to define the same i have taken the beautiful yellow color from this colorful eye shadow palette from makeup revolution i have applied it on to my eyelid starting from my inner v towards the middle part of my eyelid i have taken the beautiful red color from the same eye shadow palette and i have started applying it from the outer v of my eyelid towards the middle part of my eyelid and then mixed both the colors Then I have taken a beautiful rusty orange color from the same palette and I have used it to diffuse the colors at my crease area so that it does not look harsh. I have used the same yellow and red color in my lower lash line to create the symmetrical look. I must tell you guys this palette is so beautiful so versatile so colorful I am in just love with this palette and the colors are so pigmented and all of them are matte so I really like this palette a lot And for my eyebrow today I am using color bar eyebrow pencil I have brushed my eyebrow and then I have just drawn the natural shape of my eyebrow and gently filling it with the pencil This eyebrow pencil is very much pigmented so I have used the brush to diffuse the intensity of the color so it looks natural. For eyeliner today I am using the liquid eyeliner from Sugar and then I have drawn a short winged eyeliner. I have dusted off all the extra powders from my face. I it has already set my base beautifully. So I am not going to use any extra loose powder or a um, compact powder to set my face. For adding some more colors to this beautiful eye makeup look, I have used the peacock blue colored kajal from Color Bar and I have used it in my lower lash line and waterline. Then I have used a transparent uh, mascara from Color Bar to clean all the fallouts from my eyelash. Then I am using mascara from L'Oreal. I have applied generous coats of the mascara on my upper lashes and then on my lower lashes also. This is a voluminizing mascara. It gives good volume to the lashes. So your eyes would look very beautiful. 
then for contouring my face i am using contour and highlighter palette from color bar and i have taken the contour and applied using a brush to the hollows of my cheeks and i have applied some on my forehead and then i have applied on my jawline as well i have also contoured my nose area a little bit so my nose would look sharp then i have diffused the color of the contour using a kabuki brush so it does not look harsh Yeah, it's time for adding some colors to my cheek and for blush today I am using the Coral Climax uh, blush from Sugar and I have applied it on apple of my cheeks. This is a beautiful coral color and it is complementing this makeup look so beautifully. It's time to add the glow to our makeup look so I am using the Master Chrome highlighter from Maybelline and I am using it to the highlighting points like above my cheekbones on my uh, cupid bow tip of my nose on my forehead and some on my brow bone it is a beautiful highlighter I think you have seen me using this lot of time and I really like this highlighter a lot this is a beautiful golden highlighter I have also highlighted my inner eye corners using the same highlighter. Let's move on to the lips for outlining my lips today. I am using the lip liner from Color Bar. It is in the shade Clear Red. I have outlined my lips and then I have also filled my lips using the same lip liner. So create the base of the lipstick that I am going to apply. For lipstick today, I am using the Matte as Hell Crayon Lipstick from Sugar in the shade Cherry Darling. This is a beautiful red color and it is complementing this look so much. I can't just explain and uh, this is a beautiful creamy matte lipstick. So it would not dry out your lips but give you a beautiful look to the makeup. For setting my makeup, I have used L'Oreal Infallible Setting Spray. This is a very good setting spray. It melts down all the things together and uh, give a beautiful look. Yes, we are done. This is the finished final makeup look. I hope you have enjoyed this makeup look creation. And it's time to change. Yes, I am wearing a kurti from Cotton Galaxy and this is a Kundan uh, earring and Mangtika set and also I have paired this look with beautiful royal blue colored fingering and this matches the kurti so this completes the whole look. this look with kundan earrings and neck piece as you can see you can pair it with any heavy jewelry as per your choice yeah this is the finished final look i hope you have liked this look creation if you have liked it please hit the like button and do comment below yeah be safe be healthy and happy diwali to everyone thank you for watching